Okay, let's take this uh, Jeep Grand Cherokee 4.7 V8 for a spin. All the uh, warning lights come on and go out the way they should. All the gauges work properly. It starts absolutely on the button. Just wait for the traffic to clear and then we'll move off. I've now done uh, 75 miles on this and it's been a splendid 75 miles actually. No problems or issues whatsoever. Just lots and lots of power. If you've ever, ever driven a 4 litre one of these, um, the 4.7 V8 is just in a completely different league. So much faster, the fuel economy doesn't seem to be any worse, um, but a real joy to drive in fairness. No clunks or groans or rattles from anything, uh, just drives, so, so engine sounds lovely, gearbox seems absolutely super, no problems there. Uh, I think the tracking is very slightly out as it's uh, um, the wheel is very slightly off to the left, um, possibly been retracked at some point, but needs uh, could do with retracking. Doesn't pull badly to the left; it's just got a very slight, um, uh, very slight runoff to the left on it. Um, it's got digital split climate control, which is fully working and properly cold on this one. Uh, it's got the high power Jeep stereo, which all works fine, except there's no magazine in the. Uh, stack CD player so you'd have to get hold of a magazine from somewhere not difficult um, I think they're pretty much a proprietary brand or certainly cheap to be able to supply one you've got cruise control in front of you dial wise you've got obviously fuel gauge uh, voltmeter oil pressure which runs at around about between half and three quarters no matter what happens uh, when you're moving and temperature gauge in the corner there which shows just below the halfway mark all the time um, and then rev counter and speedo in the center um, to our right here we've got all the mirror and window controls uh, it's got power folding mirrors memory driver's seats obviously the uh, the seats are electric in the front uh, we've also got electric windows all around and electric sunroof which all uh, functions the way it should also got a trip computer on it um, up here which uh, tells us what we're doing but there's just oodles of effortless power from these uh, 4.7 V8s. As I say, they're just a complete cut above uh, the, uh, the standard 4 litre straight 6 model. Much, much nicer. So it's a very pleasant place to be all round. I was hoping to uh, give it its head up here, but um, not possible, too much traffic around. But I've had it up to sort of uh, normal motorway cruising speeds, um, and it cruises absolutely happily, no problems whatsoever. It's also obviously got remote locking, um, and we've got uh, the usual heated seats and stuff like that. Full leather. Okay, we're just about to come into where we need to turn off. I've had the cruise control working, that's all absolutely fine. That's about it. My name is Simon, you can reach me on 0771 906 9353 or in the office on 0118 946 3352 if you've got any uh, queries or points you wish to discuss about the car, give me a call. End.